We are already listening live and in the mix. Mark Farina on the Insomniac channel. On uh, on this, look at this stuff, man. Featuring. That's right. Oh yeah. featuring on my gaming channel right now with some DJ Mark Farina I'm just gonna put him there right into the mix if you guys are wondering how this is gonna work out this is the pod clash which I'll get to in a second we'll talk about it basically I'm mixing music with my games and let's uh, let's talk about that my games what am I playing today it is banner saga Banner Saga is loading. Oh, did that just end it? Oh, no, 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 it's lagging a little bit as this game loads. But Mark Farina is not going anywhere. We're gonna basically, uh, Resume or load. I guess it's the same thing, isn't it? All right, part of people, a place to be. I will be right back. We are now currently listening to Mark Farina live as he does a live set on Twitch. And I'm also channeling through my channel so that, uh, you know, you can listen to games, play games, and listen to cool music at the same time. It's called the Jade with a Pod Clash, but we haven't officially started yet, so bear with me as I go and get myself an adult beverage. And we start. One more place I'm going to advertise this guy. Go to my own little, uh, my own little Twitch. Look at that! I gotta, I'm trying to shut the goddamn volume up. Oh, is it down here? Look at that. I'm gonna close this and then I'm gonna go oh bear with me man I start my streams I should do this stuff a little bit before where's discord where's dick's cord Dixcord. Come on, start Dixcord. I'm gonna share you with the uh, with the little banner soccer community on here. This should got this says no DMCA on this channel, by the way. So it should be, I should be not getting any bullshit. Live now. With the only bot stream? That, like, I'm the only person?
Where you at, Dick's Court? How come I can't move you? Okay, cool. That's it. That's all I'm going to do. Put it in the park real quick. And then uh, I'm going to run to the fridge, get myself a nice cold brew, and let's get this show on the road. was I last time? Does this thing have a good continue? I should just be able to resume right where I was, I hope. It's been, a, it's been about a week or so since I played this. I'll tell you why. Oh yeah, we're getting to this kingdom here. The reason why um, the reason why is because I've been really focused on um, Mordheim. Kind of changes the levity of the game, doesn't it? Oh, yeah. They're like, yeah, we got a funky battle coming up. <laughs> we got a funky battle coming up, bro. Let me go talk to the king. What do they tell you? By all accounts, the dredger coming here. Looks like they plan to end the borrow for good this time. But, bro, check out these new tracks I'm listening to. Mark Farina on the decks. This place will become a killing field soon. Bro. Or a big dance hall with party people everywhere. They say the Prince of Men is here. They've got a mender too. Prince Luden is here from Arborang? In any case, we'll be giving no audience today. Remember the last time you were here, Ingvar? It's Ivir or Evir. I don't know how you say it because there's nobody who says it in this game. They didn't uh, finish hiring the goddamn voice people. What now? We find somewhere to rest. I recommend. Keeping your people out of trouble while you're here, Rook. In fact, keep them invisible. Durander won't be happy you're here. You're shown the quarters, but can wander the city while you wait for an audience. You feel like you can sleep for a week straight. But you pop that ecstasy, a special K, and all that tiredness goes away. And look at all these people, the big party people dancing on the street. They'll be dancing in the street. What do I need to market anything? I got like no renown left. I must have already used that heroes hall. They'll be dancing in the streets one time. Okay, everybody's got something that they need. Uh, I guess I got no renown. It looks like where did that all go? I must have used it all before I quit the last game to promote to do some promotions. But that seems weird. I guess I did. Map. Rest. We already know where we're at. We don't have anything for the market, so I guess we're just resting. As you settle in, you receive word to come to the Great Hall the next morning. Yuvir suggests not speaking unless addressed, and even then, keep it short. In your dreams that night, you see... Viral kings fighting with dredge lords and ominous feeling lingers as you prepare to enter the greatest of great halls. Here we go. Oh, the great hall. Got the DJ spinning the tracks. Look at the, all the people back there dancing. Greetings from Worm Toad Drunder. I brought an ally. Who are these people? We don't have time for games. Doesn't it kind of like these people are actually just sitting around waiting for their cocktails to come? 
It totally changes the wait, I know you. Oh yeah, they're in the VIP. Remain, there's no better place for us than here. We make our stand in Einertoff. But even if Einertoff falls, Avar won't be wiped out. Hakon is taking our best warriors to Arborang as we were discussing. I'm not going to Jorinder. We're needed here, says Hakon. This is not a debate. Uh oh, a messenger bursts through the doors, cluttering the tension. He says a stone singer has been cutting a path across the bridge. Gods, can we not have a moment's respite? They should not be here already. Ivan, the stone singer is with them. Let me bring down the bridge, as I said. It will buy us. I said the bridge stands, Mender. I say it again to you and the Prince of Men. This whole Mender Council. Were they here? I will not say it again. How can you go to Arborang? Ivan, do not touch that bridge. Am I understood? You are, then I'll confront the singer myself. Nobody tries to stop Ivan, but many follow as he leaves the Great Hall. Lumunder walks past the great companies of Varl on the way to the bridge. A tall, thin creature stands there, two black spears over its shoulders, ringed by dredge. The Varl have backed away in fear. Ivan stops before the stilt-legged figure. Suddenly, Evir is beside you. What is that thing? A stone singer, what is Evir? As close as the dredge come to menders of their own. I've only seen one before, it didn't go well. Can I even win this? I don't know, I think we'll find out. We should help him, of course. You expect Eber to refuse, but instead he locks eyes with you. Listen to me, Rook, he says. You'll probably die here, and so will everyone else who steps on that bridge. Look at your daughter. Are you prepared for that? Uh, you're not doing this alone. I won't stop you, he says Eber. Fight like it's your last. You're not sure what to expect, but you draw your axe and soon find yourself standing behind Ivan on the bridge, wondering if you made the right decision. Because what happens if he dies and they kill my daughter anyway? They fucking rape her, they fucking whatever, man. I'm not gonna have any of that shit. So you're telling me like, oh, I shouldn't defend my daughter. Bro. All right, we gotta figure out what happened. They replaced everybody. Let's put everybody out of here. Oh, he's required to. So these three are required. Now, who do we got? Daughter, come with me. We, you, you know what? I'll even let her fucking fight, dude. Boom. Our tanks in the front. Our guy in the back. We got two shooters. Oh, he's actually way in the back because, as I said before. Look, I can't even level him. That's funny. They gave me a guy ready to level. I can't level him. This Krumer guy's kind of tough, too, isn't he? But, uh. Hogan? Paul Kogan. We're gonna give that to you for now. We got someone else sitting on the sidelines. Who's that? Oh, that's you or you. There we go, there we go. We are ready for battle. You may fire when ready. Mm -hmm. Mark Farino. Still jamming. I don't know what you're doing, dude. You gotta you gotta kinda step back to 
Let the big boys go in the front. You having a chance. Oh, that's really bad for him. That's really bad. Sorry about that. Uh-oh, uh-oh, he's already like, let me do my spell, dude. This ain't, this ain't going good like I thought it was. This ain't going good like I thought it was gonna. best idea, huh? Wait a minute, I want to see what the... Because her, her thingamajig, her special does what? Okay. So we just need to actually... A nice shot off on that guy's armor. There you go. There you go. Oh, that's dumb. That's that's just dumb. He's gonna go up there anyway. He's going he's getting up there anyway. Get in there. Kill. There we go.
Get out of here! Get out of here! Ah! We gotta get this guy out of there. Even if that takes a sacrifice. She's gotta block him. She's gotta block him. It's okay. It's okay. She's gonna get killed, but she's saving our, our ring leader, Lita. That's the important thing. Ooh. Except for diagonal's gonna hit my own guy. I don't know if I can do that right now. Just chill for a minute. Dougie Fresh has silence. Oh, 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 oh. God, the question remains, huh? Don't let him fucks with you. Oh, this guy's this guy's going down. Downtown! That's bullshit. Is off. His arms off. <laughs> no, it isn't. <laughs> His arms off. <laughs> oh, Jesus, come on. It's a good sign. Good. All you got to do is That's a big boss for another day. But I don't see any EV or anymore. Oh no, that's not good. Every single one of my buddies who owe me money. And Habib, the video guy. The porno 
snowstorm. Guys that sell cigarettes. Nasty motherfucker. Wow, that was fucking really goddamn. This is good. This is good, though. They thought they were going to stop me there. They didn't stop shit. Oh, look at it. Your sight streams of underwater. Memories fly away like Sir Ravens before you can capture them. With great effort, remember who you are. Juno. You also realize that a monumental serpent is speaking to you now. Your last certainty was that you died some time ago and that it is about to happen again. Frustrating, says the serpent. You are too slow to understand the serpent. It speaks in a language that recalls very ancient memories of words you learned long ago. If you are not going to die, I suppose we will speak instead. Who are you? What does it matter? Perhaps you missed meaning. What I wish to know does matter. Hmm. What are you? What is your purpose? First, tell me what you are. Do you ask Hammer what the blacksmith is making? The conversation becomes more meaningless by the word. What do your prophecies say? The gods gave you prophecy, fate, destiny. Is there no child coming to slay me with a magic sword? Are there no stars in the sky foretelling this disaster? Do you truly not know? Dad, how is that? Are you a god? No. The gods are silent as and before me stands one who knows not what they have done. Listen carefully, for I will give you a prophecy. I am the end. Do you understand this world and this tapestry I would devour? It is my purpose. But I cannot. Instead, now comes a wall of night to consume your pitiful world. Wall of night? The dredge? Dredge? Stone men marching across the bridge? No. It is darkness. The egg white that has turned black. I am meant to devour the tapestry itself, not idly witness the dust smother this rot. I am incomplete, a worm crawling through a dung field. Because of you, who are you to take my destiny? What are you? Return, what is mine? Oh, so this chick somehow is the cause of all the shit and... Ivan. Juno, you're alive. You're alive! Oh, 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 hold on. Time to, time to turn this shit off. Please tell me. Welcome to Cheat Codes Christmas. Ha no, we're not gonna watch that. All right, give me just a second, party people. That was pretty cool. But what we're gonna do now is we're going to go to our go-to. That way you don't have to keep you waiting too long. And we're going to go to our favorites, and we're just going to pick one at random. Uh, excuse me. Ooh. How's this one? Let's just go with it for a minute. Back to the game. How oh, will you wait? Where am I? Asleep, I presume, or unconscious. I am in Ridgehorn, I think. The serpent was trying to kill me. Now I'm talking to you. Time is moving strangely. I've lost swaths of memories. But I found you for a short time, at least. The serpent said something about a long bridge. So I took a guess. 
We came after you. We saw the Ivan Einer top. Are you okay? I tried to turn. It tried to turn me to ashes. We spoke. I'd be surprised if that's the last we've seen of it. It could tear the land apart or crush cities if it wanted. What do we do? It gets worse. A prophecy of the gods that I've never heard of. There are still prophecies out there. It was vague. Sounded like the serpent was supposed to swallow the world. Instead, some kind of darkness or nothingness is seeping from the north. It devours whatever it touches. That would explain why the dredge is swarming on us. Like someone kicked an anthill. Ivan, are you in danger? You could say so. Bellovere is here. The Varro are holding him off, but not for much longer, I think. All of the Sunder. Why the Immortal One? Of all the Sunder, why the Immortal One? Bellovere, that is the worst of luck. I would have you come to me, but we will have to do this the hard way. Listen closely. I will return to Strand and find passage down to the Red River. You must leave Einertop and meet me in Sigurholm. Juno will never make it to Sigurholm. Bellovere is about to overtake us. Savara won't listen to a thing I... Find a way. Do whatever it takes. I will not be able to contact you again before Sigurholm. Go! And Ivan. Yes? I love you. Ooh, ooh. He's got a hot power god chick who likes to have sex with him. That's pretty cool. I want one of those. You've spent a lot of time next to him since he passed out. Just keep an eye on him. It's not like that, Dad. He, he saved Yvir. He might save the rest of us. Can he hear us? He just moved. How long was I... You're out a couple of days. How do you feel? Juno, she's alive. I need to meet her in Sigurholm. Hold on. Slow down. Who's Juno? She's my mentor on the Mender Council. She contacted me. Contacted you how? She's not like most Menders. What happened here since I passed out? Navarro holding the dredge back just barely. Bellavir has disappeared. Eber is still out of it. Drender sent hot hacking, looting, and a cu- <laughs> Hacking, loogies... And a couple hundred uh, barrel away to Arboring. I don't know how long we'll be able to hold out here. Look, I need your help. Take me to Sigurholm. Juno is going to meet us there. Sigurholm, that's got to be a week away at least. And just abandon Einertop? Maybe, or no, I could destroy that godforsaken bridge myself. That would delay the immediate threat, but Jurender will never agree to it. I need to understand a few things, Ivan. At the sounds you're about to hear, yeah, yeah, yeah. Look, I know things are, it's a, it's, it's a long story, bro. How well do you know history? You're from a very small town in the woods. What, dude, history? Uh, Black Lives Matter and... Uh, I'm not really sure, dude. I'll keep it short. You know how men and Var were made? The Loom Mother, the other gods? In the first great war, the armies of men and Varl hated each other. They fought bitterly for land and dominance. Then one of the gods created the dredge, and they were such a threat that unless men and Varl set aside their differences, they threatened to wipe out both races. So they did. They ended the war, pushed the dredge into the north, and formed an alliance that has held ever since. The second great war began generations later. The dredge rallied their forces, defeated the Varl who walked the borders and laid waste to the unsuspecting settlements throughout the world. They were led by Sunder. Powerful dredge warlords and weaver, like Bellovere. He was there in the Second Great War. Humanity was on the brink of extinction when the inner circle of Menders went forth and finally sent Sunder, the Sunder, and the Dredge deep underground. For the most part, the Dredge haven't tried to return since. Well, until now, those Menders would call Volka. Juno wasn't there herself, but she's from their bloodline. So another great war has begun? If I didn't think the world was ending, it would be incredible. Ancient history is playing out before us. What about the serpent? That's another story. I... There's nothing in the Mentor's library about that thing. It must have something to do with the dread returning. That seems likely. Why won't the Varl King destroy the bridge? I can't completely understand it myself. Last time I mentioned it, he made his mind very clear. He'll let the city and the rest of the world fall before that damn bridge. How would you collapse the bridge by myself? Not by myself, it could be blasted apart. But this bridge wasn't made to fall. It'll take time and concentration. That's why I need your help. Navarro will try to stop me. It could be holding off both the dredge and Navarro. 
Juno. What do we do about Velover? I can't stop him, but I believe Juno can. That's why we need to go. We could just leave. And let the Varl die to give us a head start? One of my first choice. I've done everything I can on my own. I need some time to think about this. I understand, but be quick, Rook. There has to be some way to... I can't believe the Varl would be so stubborn. Speak to Jordan yourself. He's in a great hall. Maybe you'll have more luck, or maybe he'll put your head on a spike. Rook, I hate to put this all on your shoulders, but I got a few hens, friends here. Come to a decision quickly. Either we, we can't stay. You have to make it to Sigur home. You know what know what to do. Ugh, let's go to the Great Hall. I'll talk to the king. Joiner, you'll do as I say. I'm not here to argue. I'm telling you that we're dying by the dozens every day now. We sent our best away with Hacken. How long do you expect this to last? You asked for this command, Fazal. Don't let them get across that bridge. Thank you for your audience. I forgot your name. Rook. Rook, how is Ingvar? Will he survive? I think so. I remember Ingvar well enough. He hasn't told you why he faced down Belavir, did he? I would be interested to hear. Ingvar confronted the Sundarin as you during the Great Wars. He won that fight. None other but the Minders have done that. He proved us stronger. Maybe he thought to do it again. I've killed a Sunder? Have you ever killed a Sunder? How did he end up in Skogar? You'd have to pry that information here from yourself. I don't know. He disappeared when the last king tried to name him Kender. Hold on. All right, a little bit quieter, please. Just a tiny bit. There we go. Good, good, good. It occurs to you that Grinder would not be the throne now. But why are you here? Rookie Breed. I'm offering. We're all at stake here. I'm over 400 years old and I know that I know little. You're a child, an infant, and yet you know everything. Listen, human, the story is not about you. If you jump from that bridge today, the world would not change. Now either help phase out, retake it, or leave my city, I don't care which. Guards are quick to usher you from the Great Hall. You don't resist. Who do I got in my goddamn company? That's it. These home slices right here. I'm not seeing a lot of promise. Everybody's got mad shit. <sighs> now I have to make a decision, and the decision's got to be one or the other, and that is destroy the bridge or fight on the bridge. If I destroy the bridge...
I'm gonna make an enemy of a lot of Varro. If I fight on the bridge, can we turn the tide? Ugh. It seems like we have a huge army. I gotta make a decision here, man. To go against the king? Or to fight with him? Ah, oh, man. What do I gotta do? I'm gonna flip a fucking coin. Where's the coin? I'm gonna let the fates decide, Holmes. That's what I'm gonna do. Here's the coin. Okay. Okay, heads. Heads is, I don't even know what's on this, this thing. I can't even see it. It's an old coin. All right, the dirty side means that I'm gonna go dirty and destroy the bridge. The clean side means I'm gonna, it's not really clean side, but it's the cleaner side means I'm gonna fight on the bridge. Dirty side, destroy the bridge. Ivan nods when you tell him you'll help him destroy the bridge. He reminds you of the plan. Get him out onto the bridge and give him time to strike it until dread falls. And until it falls. And hold off anyone who comes to stop him. Dread for a while alike. Not yet, I need to prepare. Well, I'm gonna still keep all these guys. I wonder if they're gonna give it to me extra. He's already hurt, too. That really sucks balls. Like, he can't get hit once. All right, let's just do it. Okay, okay. You might be sitting back. Yeah, they're not forcing me on it, so that's good. You're listening to Ronnie Size on tonight's Essential Mix. Ronnie Size. This is not over yet. I don't see any Varro, but I know they're gonna send some. Ooh, look at this big fucking nasty bastard. First blood. First blood. <laughs> Fuck these losers. Get in there, get in. No, 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 no! No!
There we go, there we go. Who knew that was coming, you fucking pussy? Fuck you, loser! a special attack. Yeah, we don't want him to do that, though. They'll take him right the fuck out. Let's try it. Don't do it.
shit. It's a back and forth battle, that's for sure. Navarro, so I hope this I hope there's no Navarro battle after this. Please tell me there's not. Then the Varo okay, here we go. We gotta defend them, we gotta do it. Stay close, Kelly, I was drawing your act. I love you shaking so hard, you can see that from a distance. Without shout, files all attacks. Now I just lost my goddamn, but you didn't you just help me, you fucking idiot? We're not gonna make it. Make it. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Ten. Oh, that's really handy. That could be super handy, as a matter of fact. not work the way I wanted it to. I thought it might cure him. It really didn't. <laughs> Okay. Oh, well. It's gonna be a tough one because my guys are all fucked. This time we only have to hold him off though.
Yikes. I'm okay with that. Hogan and Hogan in the house. having trouble thinking that that's gonna be all right no we're not gonna do anything extra because her dad's gonna hit here in a second and it's over with at that point like mr. Lober Lober right here we we'll make sure of it that's right bitch I think we got it. I think we I think we failed. And this is probably one of those death missions too. Dad. 
done. What good is that gonna do? I just lost the fucking battle. Am I ending my stream and playing something else, or is there more to the story that meets the eye? We're gonna find out right now. Well, I might have just. I might be ending the fucking stream right now. Oh, maybe I'm not dead. <laughs> no, I'm not dead. Otherwise, it would have just said. Like, after that battle, it would have said, you died. So I'm still in the game. I just won a bunch of... I just lost that battle. I guess I was supposed to lose it. I don't know. <laughs> oh, a shadowed figure enters the room, Bobby Classic. Oh, it's Evere with his one arm. You're missing a lot. This this game is like a fucking soap opera, man. There's a lot of cool shit going on. And uh, you missed some epic shit. You should have you should have here got here earlier. How's your day? Yeah, it's a fun game and it was like fucking probably 4 bucks, but there's like three different uh, installations. There's like Banner Saga 1, Banner Saga 2, and Banner Saga 3. Do you wonder if this fight could have not been won? They tried to do what you would not do. Oh, look it! The man is backing me up for the decision I made. Kick ass. And this guy with the one arm right now is actually one of their, uh, one of their bigwigs. Enough of this insolence. I want these people out of my city. And this is the old asshole king. Oh, challenge him. That's right. For a thousand years from now, we are all there is, and we will be gone someday. You will destroy what we have made. What else is left of us? Will we leave no trace behind, as if we never existed? Now get out of what is left of my lands and my city, and never return. Yeah, that's a smart thing to do, is just start splitting everybody up when there's a goddamn apocalypse going on, and we're already outnumbered, you fucking idiot. What a fucking idiot. Of our bones to the hills or whatever. <laughs> well, so is the beer that I'm drinking right now. Okay, I gotta get a camp. Hold on, hold on. Camp, 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 camp. Oh, shit. I can't camp for shit. I got, like, no goddamn supplies. I just gotta keep... I gotta push through. Is there anybody... Ooh, ooh, ooh. Hold on, hold on. I just used one day supply. I'm probably gonna round a fucking, uh... I'm gonna take the risk. Because if I rest one more day, I'm healing, like, half my crew. And we're gonna starve anyway, unless some miracle happens. So I guess here we go. Ah! <laughs> Alright, here we go. So I gotta basically go like this. What are you watching on? Are you on Facebook or Twitch or where are you at? Oh, you're not on Facebook because my Facebook chat's broken. So you're on either Twitch or YouTube. YouTube. Alright, Iver is back with his one arm ass. The fuck could he do with one arm? Never underestimate the power of the dude with one arm, though. Hold on, hold on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Awesome. Yeah, I don't know. I have Sheep Chat, which is like a free program, but it's made by some Russian dude. I think it's like one person, probably. And they haven't figured out how to get Facebook working. I mean, so I'm on PolyStreamer, which is the dirt cheap multi-stream program. So you can stream to as many platforms as you want. And it's like 12 cents an hour or something ridiculous or 14 cents an hour. 
And then I'm on Sheep Chat, which is how you connect all the different plate, all the different stuff onto one platform. Uh, that way I don't have to pay like, I don't know how much money you'd, I, it's, I'm probably saving really not that much money. I should probably just get on something like Streamlabs and pay a bunch of money per month or whatever. But uh, this guy's actually been cool with me, this poly streamer guy. So I'm trying to support him. All right, who, what are we, who are we gonna level up? Oh, well. Remote. It, oh, I got no renown anyway. I can't. I can't promote anybody. So I guess that's a moot. That's a moot point. All right. Let me make sure my heroes are all straightened out, though, so that there's nobody injured. So everybody's good. I got a tank. He used to be a tank. And I think I need to put my big ass wizard in there somewhere. Wizard. I think it's good. Wizard, warrior. Hogan and Mogan, the, the Death Brothers. Yeah, I would be down for that. We still have to do uh, the game that we're already playing together anyway. The Div Divinity or Original Sin or whatever that's called. All right, I'm gonna take these guys out. We need, he's a half, this guy can fight and shoot. This guy is more backdrop, he ain't fighting nobody. And then we need this tank. All right, let's continue. Let's hope that they don't run us out of steam here. All right, we gotta hope for a miracle. We gotta hope for a miracle. Where's the food? Where's the goddamn supplies? We only got three days supplies. Oh no! Yeah, 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 exactly. There's gonna be some I record with no music and some I record with, with music. The reason why I have to split it up, the ones with music. Oh, perfect! I bet this is. I bet. Hold on, hold on. Pull you back to attention. Flames quickly consume a supply wagon and a few. T oh, I don't need my supply wagons. I have no supply. My boy and points to a burning tent and closes the out, out, outlying viral. Viral of the Viking looking dudes, by the way. Two of the giant. They're giant Vikings. Two of the giants are motionless. Staring at the spreading fire with tear in her eyes. Come on, Navarro, to help. Lead by example! Wrapping your cloak around you, the smoke flames attack becomes a blur as you grab the boy and slice through the back canvas with your hunting knife. You meet the ashamed look of the older Varl while the crowd cheers. See that shit? But I guess I'm out of food. <laughs> What the depth was that about you, butter to yourself? Something about the fire. Adiv tells you, I've heard of this place before. They don't like it. Doesn't change what happened, do you think, to yourself? N now what the fuck? What happens if I'm out of food? I'm just out of food. I'm fucked. Game over. So this game actually is is also the one I'm playing now is based on like kind of like what you said the other game is based on all these little seemingly um, you know innocent like conversations all the choices I make have some sort of uh, I'm not gonna make a joke I'm impressed that you kept it together this long kind of a passive aggressive thing. What is really, so this game splits up like a soap opera. You got different chapters going on, and you play the different the different characters. So you might play one group one minute, and then you might play a different group the other minute. And but you're not always playing the same characters. It's pretty cool. So 
someone had to. What do you mean? Bellovir is hating this way. Ooh, we don't want that guy. Alrighty, how is that possible? A group of borrow from Wormtoe showed up. I tried to break the bridge, but you guys fucking stopped me. Probably would have taken care of that shit, you idiot. The long way. Bellovir and his army chased them across the summer path, they said. Was the summer path on the fucking side of the bridge that I tried to destroy and you guys stopped me? Oh, wait, that's not what the, he's a pass whim to. That doesn't make any sense. Belavir was at the bridge. The fucking bridge you guys stopped me from destroying. Remember that? He must have doubled back after the serpent appeared. While we fought on the bridge, he led half of his forces around to approach Einerthal from behind. The attacking of the bridge was a feint. Oh, you missed, you missed me basically bitching about these assholes not letting me destroy the bridge and now they're bitching because the big boss happened across the bridge and is chasing us and he's not that far behind. And I'm like, well, maybe let me destroy the fucking bridge next time. Don't <laughs> they're not clever. You guys are fucking dumbasses for not letting me destroy the fucking bridge. <laughs> Maybe not, he's following you. Yeah, I thought one of you might know why. I know why, because you assholes didn't let me destroy the fucking bridge. Okay, you're exchanging. <laughs> Sorry, you exchange nervous glances, but nobody speaks up, because we all are fuck. We already know what the elephant in the room is. Must be me then, he bears it. Not your fault, you got knocked out, your arm chopped off, while we were trying to save your goddamn race. Is there something I don't know? That's quite a grudge he's holding on. It's coming for you, I Ever. Doesn't matter. Only chance is to get the cigar home. You know what I know what to do. We'll join you. I bring supplies and warriors. Woo! Supplies. We need the supplies. I believe he's happy to swing it for you. Look at that. 46 supplies. Hold on. I'm gonna... 46 supplies is equal to seven days. All my guys are healed, so I'm not gonna stop the caravan. We're just gonna let it go. Hold on, where's the map? This is where we're going, by the way. Where are we going? I'll remember as soon as you the fight the name of the place. So we're here and we're going to Well we went we were there, and now we're I guess we're into the crossroads. Yeah, we got way more than seven days to go. I think we're going, yeah, we're going, we're going to Sigur home. And there ain't no way we're going to make it on seven days supplies. But there's usually like stuff on the way. I guess we'll see, man. Bravely bold Sir Robin. Caravan stops at a split in the road ahead. The path leading the Sigur home wheels off into the hills, which are now suing with familiar black shapes. Dredge that way too, grimaces Ivan. The summer path leads straight to Sigur Home. While taking the main road will add several days. They're every way by now, replied Uben. I suggest we go around past Hauptstork. Uh, Uben is the smart guy. I should listen to him. Even though I could send scouts, but then it's like, we don't know. So the summer path leads straight to Sigur Home while taking the main road will add several days. I can send scouts. Let's go around past Hopdork. I hate to say it, because that Ubin guy is smart. He, he's like a scribe, he's like the giant scribe. Who knows all this shit? Hoping. Well, I don't have any supplies, so it's probably a good idea to go to Hauptstorp. Oh, yeah, there it is. Not too far away. We can make that and get supplies there. Boa Shawa. Boom, 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 boom. Harsh words from one mother to another draw the attention of the entire caravan. My daughter marries Ragni or no one. The reed thin tramp you call a daughter won't provide sons. The insulted mother bears her teeth ready to attack. You gotta be you gotta get in it. You can't just let them argue. Explain yourselves! You gotta get in there. Ragni chooses my daughter on his own. The insulted mother says, 
but this one thinks I have something to do with it. Launching forward. The first one flails Wiley shouting, Liar! The women are separated and eventually calm down, but you worry that this is far from over. Are you still there? Do you want to play something? I can I can end it here and we can fucking duo something. Oh no, that's cool, then do your thing, whatever. But I'm doing something else, I gotcha. <clears throat> that's okay, I, I'm, I'm chilling. I'll keep playing this. I don't play games enough. I got so many games I gotta beat still. I'm so behind. I'm, gonna, I'm, I'm doing a recruitment drive. You make a convincing argument about leaving town before the dread sweep through and do a fair job of convincing everyone to be completely terrified. They start packing. It remains to be seen whether you can keep them as safe as you say. Oh, there's some clansmen. This little piggy went to market. I gotta get all sorts of goddamn supplies. Hold on, let me look at the map. So these dots, I assume, make me in a day. Well, now I'm over here, and I gotta go to Sigur home. Are we going this way? That's what we're doing. Holy fuck, we're going way around. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, we're going to Hoverstock, so we gotta, oh, we only need, we need one, two, three, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 23, roughly, until we're there, 24 days of supplies. So that means I guess 15? Well, that's better than nothing. What do you want? Oh, Glenolf is back. So, just wanted to know anyone who can cleave a dread and two like that a little better. I'm Rook. Want to know? Who been asked me to chop a dread and two? I chop them. All right, hold on, I'm gonna go to the fridge. Be back in 10 seconds. a decent change. Yes, long time. When I was young, I fight for another bar. It did not work out. But I learned to swing a sword. Ruben pays well. Gives me plenty of things to kill. To be honest, maybe too many things these days. I like that sword, huh? No, I love this sword. Given by the old Skrilramir himself. When I was still working for Ruben, he says, I protect the king's collection. I protect the king. It all makes an expression somewhere between pain and frustration. I couldn't save it, though. He makes a hand motion like an object falling from a tall height and exploding. Mattered a lot at the time. I think it doesn't matter now. 
Skrymir is dead. Alright. Keep the food in the cart. I got new heroes. Gun off is level four. Sorry, Ona, you gotta get the fuck out of Dodge. Thanks for joining for a brief moment. Appreciate it. One day, maybe I'll have people following me. <laughs> It'll be more fun in the chat. Break it, break it down. Let's go, let's go. It's like an adventure all on its own. I'm playing the game as an adventure, the chat is an adventure, my friends show up out of the blue, this kind of stuff. Look at that, chuck one of their clansmen. The caravan stops to watch a judge pulling into the city. You just passed through. I hope anyone who stayed got out alive says a lot, but you have your doubts. Awesome! Awesome! Because I told everybody, let's get the fuck out of Dodge, and most people listen. train these bitches that's right look at all this cool stuff coming together that's right let's go I'm not, I'm not we're no we're not going back I already told everybody let's get the fuck out of Dodge they're coming and most people listen I said, I, but this is cool. I, I got a lot of people who came with me. Some clansmen have discovered a large patch of wild fruit. When you approach, you, fresh fruit. When you approach, <laughs> you see some people have begun to sample them. Sampling the fresh fruit. Uh, a mother frets about whether they're safe after overhearing one of the children say that it tastes funny. Others start gathering by the basket full. Think about yourself. Take a bite. It's drunkard fruit, so it tastes weird because it's a little bit fermented, and that's good. We need some fucking drunkard fruit. Let's go. Are right, we gonna go up? You're to, listening uh, to the Essential Mix on 97 to 99 FM this week with Ron yes, Sons. we are. Hold we on. Continue. Hold on. I need to go print screen. There we go. When the sun aligns, the statue makes a face and a whole body of a warrior. That's what happens. You gotta be in the right place at the right time, and then it's like, kapow! 
God's tone of thunder passes around you. Ooh, it looks like my music is done. Hold on, let me double check. We don't want my music to be done. It is done. So far, we've had some really awesome... This is a long stream if it's really lasted that long. I can't believe how fucking long this stream has been. And I'm still in it. I'm still in it to win it. I got I got the... Uh, whew. What are we gonna what are we gonna do next? Let's do too many DJs. When I actually The Godstone of Dunder Pastor Oh yeah, blah 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 held together only by the deep snow. Curiously, when standing between the stones, the wind drops off completely, picking up once again once you pass through. Stay here overnight. I, I agree. You walk around the camp before settling in. Along each strand of Dunder's massive beard has carved a different part of history, and you turn your head to and fro to read it. <laughs> No fun, my baby. When, well, the loom mother was the first great. She soon found a counterpart in Dunder, who embodied her ideals in a masculine form. Dunder took some of her creations, gave them beards, and showed them the secret of smithing. That's the borrow. Too many remember him just as fondly for teaching them games and songs of mirth. I could. An offering box. The box is an elaborate construction of interlocking pieces which slide around when touched. We can get it open, they tell you. It's like a puzzle. <sighs> because I'm a spiritual man, and I, I personally, I don't believe the gods are really dead. I ain't fucking with the altar, man. Leave it. Let's get out of here. Yeah, no, we're not. I don't care. Maybe there's an artifact in there. But that's for the gods, man. You don't fuck with that shit. Look at how green it is now that I did the right thing. No fun, my baby. No fun. Hold on. Our mother screams, slow the caravan. Her daughter lies dead in a tent. We all know who did this. She spits. Staring directly at the woman she's coupled with previously. Murder of our marriage, and these times something must be done, I curse them. Investigate the death. A healer joins you in inspecting the young girl's corpse. An old infection, says the healer. No punctures, no choking, no poison. She died of a disease. He reports news to the caravan. The mother admits that she had always known her daughter was ill, and everyone moves on. See that shit? You don't just have a fucking vote. You say, okay, what's going on? What's going on? If we have an investigator, fuck yeah, let's do it. Well, we got all the way to Hork's, Hork's door. <laughs> fucking Hawk's door. In the distance, Hawk's and Storkin smolders like an old campfire. Oh my god. Well, it looks like a dead town, remarks Evere, can bring in person. There's usually survivors, I'll be reminded. Yeah, let's check it out. I hope others would do the same for me. Dredge are nothing we haven't faced before. Evere grunts, but otherwise says nothing. Besides, it might throw Bellavere off the sun a bit. You had a day's march out towards Housedorf. Dork. Housedorf. As soon as you step foot in a small town, you think you've made a mistake. It's thoroughly littered with corpses. But in moments, a drag her upon you as you stir an angry hornet's nest. You draw your weapons. Yeah, I'm gonna fuck them up. Fuck you, you fucking cunts. Let's go. I got your, I got your fucking... I want to level him. He's... Let's wait. I like her too. 
But we're going to have to just kind of Let's go with what we got Show them what you got Show, show, show them what you got Let's go I don't like the setup So is he no longer a tank? I don't have any tanks fight with one arm. Get out of here. Out of town. That from the hunter. The fray. Ladies with an attitude, fellas that are in the mood. Don't just stand there, let's get to it. Strike a pose, there's nothing to it. Ladies with an attitude, fellas that are in the mood. Isn't there a way we can, um... I do like that idea. He's like, bitch, are you for real? I'll be happy to give you what you want for breakfast. Oh, 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 eat that, motherfucker! Get out of there! Fucking simpleton cunt! Get out! I guess you're gonna go back in this corner until we can figure out what to do with you, to say they really like to aggro your ass, don't they? I do that? You ask why did I do that? I'll tell you why, didn't it? I don't need these guys rushing up on my healer guy or my that's what they're gonna do anyway. Just 
Sorry, buddy. Bye, bitch. The brothers, the brothers Grimm just fucked that dude up. What's the point then? Just give him a good one. Fuck it, man. Lightning bolt that cunt. Just one. Bye bye, son, bitch. You don't know who I be. Your mammy never tell you how to fuck with me. If I get your head, you'll never leave. Don't you dare, don't you fucking dare! On the black hand side, look at here, boy, don't you even try. Make me dislocate your spine, my rings make shine like turpentine. What you coming around here not for? Baby, hell no, you just want my dough. Get your black ass on the float. Who touch me, that's a no, no. Mr. DJ, won't you play that song? Tell the freaks, shake they nasty thongs. Hey, boys, won't you sing along? Cause we gonna have a party till the early morning. I gotta give him credit for using Elastica as their fucking beats, though. You can't, you can't, I can't get mad at that. You're gonna come in. Oh, you're serious? Oh, you're gonna take him out, huh? Oh, you didn't. You didn't take him out. That was your first mistake. Ugh, berserker rage on that bitch. Oh, and then this poor guy, he's gonna get hit with the kitchen sink. Hold on, hold on. We're doing the kitchen sink, as I said, as I said before. Wait, are we doing the kitchen set? That's all right. Mosh pit. Oh, he did not survive the mosh pit. You guys who are injured just get rotated out until I find suitable rest. Let it all go. This town is nothing but ghosts and now covered in more dredge bodies too. Remarkably, as you're about to leave, you find an old man sitting quietly in a tattered market stall with a couple of items in front of him. He hums themselves. As if nothing were wrong and seems to be in shock, your clansmen gather him into the camera before you leave. He's probably some mystic fucking fuck face. They're doing some cool jobs on this mix. They're mixing in the fucking the, the clash and they're mixing in fucking uh, this R&B stuff. 
like classic R&B, I guess you could say. What do you got? What do you got, love? I don't know if we've ever spoken. I'm Nib. I'm Nib. You're Rook. I know. We've actually been trying to go for a long time. Yeah, I mean, I, I, we spoke because you fucking killed those people, and I said, let's go. When you, I know you're trained by Odd Leaf. Every day I pass people I swear I've never seen before, except for you, because this isn't the first time we spoke. I don't know why you're acting like this. I want to thank you for letting me join you. Why would I ask her, have you always been such a good shot? When my chick trained her, I already know what the fuck. Where are you from? I don't think, I, I don't think you're from Skogir. I knew most people from there. No, I had a house in Frost Valley, but we were driven out when the dredge started to show up. My husband died trying to protect our home, and now I'm horny, and I want to have some fucking hot man action, and you're the leader, and who else would I go for? for the hot man action but you. Oh, and, and, and by the way, my sons and I were thrown into the fields. I'm sorry. That kills men killed my husband. When we left, I was angry. Why was I the one who had to leave their home? How do I deserve this? I don't know, let's go back to my tent and have some fucking tea. Not sure what to say. I, that's what I would've, what do you mean not sure what to say? That's exactly what it says. Let's go discuss it in my tent. But I've let it go. I have three sons. I don't want them to grow up with hatred in their hearts. That's why I want to thank you. What a douchebag. What this guy don't think of anything of it. We all have our problems to deal with. Let me know if you need to put an arrow in something. Oh, this guy. This guy. Dude, I mean, just once in a while, you're like, hey, I agree with you. It's really rough out here. Why don't you come back to my tent? And we can just relax. I got some fucking mead back there. We can chill out for a minute. Pretty cool, man. It would be. It would be. I'd be my pleasure. No, it's fine. No, no, you're not imposing. No, you don't have to. Of course, you don't have to. You want to go hang out? Do whatever you want to do. But I'm just saying, my tent is always open. That's all I'm saying, man. If you ever want to hang out. You know, just kind of get crazy, talk about, you know, let some, let loose some of that stuff. I am ready, whenever you are. So we're going to Sigur Home still. We got about, I don't even know how many days we got. It's like 20 days probably from here. La, 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 la. Oh. We're in the market. La 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 la. Oh, wait, 16 is pretty close though. And then we can level some of our heroes. La 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 la. Uh, 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 oh, uh. Okay, you're out of battle and you're out of battle. You know, you're out of battle, I just said. And it is like, dude, I want to do this. Nidalee? Oh, that's who that is. That's Nidalee. You turn into a fucking uh, lion tiger chick, too? Who to level is the question. Level him? Can't promote him. I don't have enough money for him. Uh, 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 oh. Wow, he's still got more room for promotion. Let's put this groomer guy on there, too. How's that? Good? Do we have people who don't need to level? Let's do that. Let's, oh, this is what I like to do in a lot of games, though. Like, if you haven't leveled, let's put you in and get you in the rotation of leveling. That way I can pick and choose who I want to level later. But they do a good job in this game of really fucking you up. Of not letting you level. Wow. 
What's your name, baby? Do you know what Turn down your motherfucking music. All right, let's go. Let's DJ. Scott returns with a nearly frozen child. I almost stuck on her in the snow. Looks like she must have been running for something. It says, Patch the blue model her pale skin, but her chest rises and falls. Even just carrying her along could kill her in a state like this is a woman. We could be in danger here. Point out to another. Let's go. We need other survivors. You never need to doubt it. I'll make you so sure about it. All right. I don't care. Yeah. There's always. We're always looking for my people. We're always looking out for my people. If you should ever leave me, the life would still go on. Believe me. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Time, time out. Wait, how do I pause this? Oh, no, 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 no. I want to go back to the game and pause it. Okay. All right, first of all, we're going to save this one. Did we already save it? I think we did. New. We're going to save this. I don't know if it's his name. I don't remember his name. Something like that. Boom. These are all covers. That's why. You're wondering what I'm doing? I'm making goddamn covers. Because I make my own covers. I make cover, cover, cool ass covers. I make them on my own. I'm pretty good at it. Ingrid, all the way down the hill. The odd thing is, he tells you, is that the writing occasionally changes depending on who you, is reading it. Usually, it describes the history of the gods, but it can be about nearly any topic. Sadly, Ivan doesn't know how to read it himself. Juno could, he says. Okay. As you're reading to depart, you hear screams from near the main godstone. The same voice, so curious about the dead dredge before, shrieking and pointing. For a moment, you think it must have been dead, but then you see that they have op opened a wrapping that was in the dredge's hands. Wait, says Hyper, his arm across your chest. This shouldn't be seen. Get everyone away. A chill sweeps over you. All that pushes past and gas. Stop, child TV. But the curious onlookers have already seen it. Fucking idiots. What's wrong with these people? Leave it. That's a, a baby. That dredge is a woman? We've been killing women? We've been slaughtering women and children this whole time? Leaving them to die? It's a war. It's only the males who fight. We've been fighting this dredge the whole way. Why are women with children on their backs attacking us? They're not invading. They're running. Everyone stops in their tracks. The entire caravan is gathered around a gas. When I spoke to Juno, she told me something was coming. She didn't know what. A darkness. Something black is covering the world. And the dredger running from it just like we're running from them. The serpent. The quaint. It's all the beginning of the end. Yvir, you knew. Why? Why didn't you say something? Because we're in war. I'm not going to pressure this guy. You beer? I'll just ask him. When I was young, I killed one of the Sunder. During the Second Great War, we called it Raise. Every time we would build our defenses, it would flatten them and push us back again. I became separated from the rest of the barrel and stumbled upon Raise deep in a snowstorm. Alone. 
She was nursing. I threw my axe and twisted it away and her son died in her arms. She was so pathetic, kneeling in the snow. She didn't even try to stop me when I took her head. That's how I killed the Sunder. When I found my way back to Grofheim, Devara wanted to make me Kender next to, ki next to be king. I left, walked until I ended up in Skogur, where no one knew what I had done. Yeah, it kind of sucks, man. We're in a war situation. All right, Hellboy, we're gonna do the Hellboy thing. You argue strongly for showing mercy and humanity. Some of the women in the caravan hesitantly agree to take in the dread infant, while others are furious about bringing it along. No, dude, it's Hellboy. This could be one of our uh, saviors. Not long after one of the women comes to you, it's swaddling was being held by Vic. He says, giving you a pair of pen that looks sickly undredged like. An inscription uh, on the silver almost slips your notice. Persevere. From the goddess herself, if you ask me, the woman tells you. Check that out. Check that out. All right, is it time to play something else? Am I gonna, am I gonna kind of leave it here? It seems like this game could just go on and on and on and on. All right, one more battle. How about that? One more battle and then I'm calling it quits. I think I've made some cool decisions. You're making the usual rounds when you hear a rather loud debate coming from an area that Varl have gathered. Yvir joins you as you approach. Uh, well, if Yvir is there, then we're all good. Ruben, you'd rather be known for falling asleep and dying in the corner of a meat house than battling asunder? Ruben, no, I'd rather be known for not dying. Don't even know what you're worried about. I did this a hundred times in the Great Wars. Take some warriors, plow headfirst into the dredge, they follow you into the hills, get lost. Now they're not following you. Ruben, when, I, when you did this a hundred times, did they have Belover leading them? Have you never heard about the time I hit Belover in the head with a throwing axe? Oh, you baby. I need to I need to sing some of this tonight, but not this version. Both far will hold the debate when they suddenly notice you watching. <laughs> Don't stop on my account, bitch! Careful, my friend. A lot of old history going thrown around here. The warriors were were just nothing. Noting that there's a damn good number of judge on our asses. Bellovere pulling up the rear. This one thinks he can just wander up there and throw them off our tracks. How about some gratitude, says Kromer. Thought you'd be happy to finally be the oldest barrel on the land, Ubin. I'm never happy to lose more barrel, Kromer. Besides, I'm not convinced you're really older than me. Old rival you've got here. Comments like that remind me. I've already wasted too much time doing nothing. In the old days, I'd already be halfway to the battlefield by now, speaking of which. You coming in, Var? You could ask Belavir for your arm back. Don't think so, not exactly in the mood right now. Alright then, I'll tell Hardberg you said hello. Is he going to come back? He always has before. But this time feels different, I fear. Ah, oh, fuck me. Oh, you fucking loser. But he is, he's, he's only a level one, so it's not like the end of the world, but for fuck's sake, man. All right, we're going to take a break. All right, everybody chill, chill, chill. We got to see where we're at. That dirty cunt. I'm not ready for double shooters yet. They're too, like, I think we need, if this is gonna be always six, that's bad. But hopefully at some point we can have more than six. It just seems like it's too hard to have. You need frontline, man. In this game especially. I can't have my guys 
He's getting fucking chopped down because there's too many archers. Let's go. A resolute voice calls from somewhere in front of you. The stunning terrain comes alive with armed fighters surrounding the caravan. No need, no need for blood, Chad, the leader says. Leave a couple of wagons and pretend you never even stopped here. How about you leaving what you got instead? The cop car takes leave of a surprise for a moment. We don't have time for this nonsense, this is odd leaf. Losing an arrow before anyone can react, the brigand leader falls over in a spray of blood. Thank you! Something sinister in the wake. Krumer laughs about this turn of events, convinces the rest of the brigands to give up on their... <laughs> I like your girl, Rookie says. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> I'm like, dude, I forgot how to raise morale. Do I have to rest a lot before morale is, is restored? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Let's get some good morale. Lead. There we go. Gather around, doubters. Echoes a shout in the distance as Krumer and his band of warriors break through a nearby foliage and behold the invincible Varro. The caravan is thrilled to see Krumer return safely. The plan work? Ask for work, he responds Krumer. Of course it worked. Same old dredge. Should be another day or two at least before they even find their own asses. And as you apologize, I'll tell you how I found these, Krumer said, tossing a pair of leather gloves. It looks big enough for the viral. He leans in close whispering so Ubon can't hear. Had something to do with a raven's nest and a hair tie. All right, we're gonna check all this shit out. We got a lot of artifacts at Sigur home. I think I'm just gonna stop here, even if there is a battle or not. This is a long ass video. right back to the game for a second this is an important an important quest thanks for joining me I'm not done yet though but we're at the end of course of my stream today at one catastrophe or another says odd leaf as you pull in cigar home the town appears to be sinking into the lake townspeople peek from dark windows and makeshift hobbles further up the hill no says Ivan looking frantic where is she he runs to the front of the caravan, looking out over the water. Juno isn't there, and you get the creeping feeling you're not welcome either. Going upriver looks out of the question. The beach is bare, aside from the occasional skeleton of a ruined fishing boat. We reluctantly set up camp in a sinking town. All I'm saying is, how long are you willing to wait? While taking stock of the caravan, you didn't brilliantly walk into a debate between Idloff and Ivan. As long as we need you. No, your chick's not here, dude. Probably was a dream. She's probably up in the ether ethereal planes. As long as we need to. I think we need to get out of here. I don't feel good about this place. Why? What's wrong? Something doesn't feel right. The people here are staring at us like vultures in the waist. I'm sorry, Ivan. I think Oddleaf is right. I saw a man. The whole time we were setting up, he was just watching me. Uh, in a creepy way. You gotta listen to your women. They know this stuff. You don't always listen to women, by the way. <laughs> I'm such a dick. But in this case, I think you gotta listen to the women. And how long before the dredge find us here? Juno will come. No, dude, come on. Your girlfriend. You're gonna have to let your dick fucking calm down. Just give a little more time. Look for it. Blah, blah, blah. blah. You need to trust me on this.
I don't know. I don't know if I trust him on this. He fucking failed at the bridge. You know, his idea about let me crash the bridge fucking went into goddamn flames. Got a bunch of my people hurt. Give him those plus five gloves. Give her the plus three. Boom, give him the plus three. Wait, didn't he already have something? I guess he's got that. Yes, it's the better one. That's definitely the better one. Okay. Whew. We're going to keep it like this. Christ almighty. All right. Let's hear your fucking story. Let's hear it. You're really worried about her, aren't you? What, oh, Juno? Worry doesn't begin to describe it. If she doesn't find us here or something has happened to her, are you sure what you saw was real? It could have been a dream, like I said. Or I don't know. You were pretty exhausted, dude. I don't know, to be honest. I'm not really sure anymore. Everything is a blur. Or don't tell you as I said that. I have to hope it wasn't just a dream. How exactly does weaving work anyway? Well, the hardest part is usually seeing the threads. Everything is part of the tapestry. It's made of the threads woven together. If you can see the threads, you can manipulate them. I don't know how to explain it, really. It's just like trying to play a harp with invisible strings. Look at the, my staff, for example. Some menders carve intricate patterns in the wood to help them remember the shapes of... Or, like I said, hard to explain. Being a mender, I guess I've really not thought about that. It's just part of me. I knew very young that I would join the order. Born into it, you could say. My mother and father both menders. The guard, the guild is... There are lots of people now, builders and healers. Do they all pull lightning out of the sky? No, that's not normal. It's one of the reasons I know Juno. She's one of the council. She helps me control things I, like this so we don't end up scaring people. Is that a hockey stick? No, it's not a hockey stick. Why are the bill over here? Uh, I saw Grafheim as it burned. Why are we looking? The sunder blew through it like a tempest. The varl fell into thousands. Most of the sunder left the city and headed south. Who knows where they are now? They might be destroying every town they come to or heading towards Arbarang. Bellavir stayed, stayed in Grofheim uh, just uh, for the sport of it, I think. As we fled to Einertoft, I th thought he must uh, want to wipe the varl off the map completely, but then he came after us. Maybe he knew Evir was the one who killed Raze. Maybe, but I just think, uh, make sure he doesn't catch up. Do you think this is the end times? I don't know what to think. I wish I could give you a better answer, even if we escape the dredge. That serpent said a darkness was covering the world. I don't know how long that will take or what it means even. I'm just trying to solve one problem at a time. The lenders are in Arboring. If we can find ships and make the capital, we might have a chance. All right, brother, take care. I appreciate the talk. It's a good stay grounded. I spent all day worrying about the Serpents of Sunder. I think a lot of people are intimidated or scared, maybe, of me. Don't worry. It's nothing new. I'm used to it. Maybe sometime we can talk about the things that don't include the word ending. Maybe, brother man. Maybe. I have no renown left for any of that shit. I got heroes in the tent. They're all, they're all ready to go. Everybody's in good shape. Let's get the fuck out of Dodge. But before we do that, I'm gonna get out of here. We're just gonna leave it and quit the game.
everybody uh you guys have been fun uh whoever joined me i appreciate it the music is done the pod clash is done jade with a pod clash like share and subscribe i'm gonna play something else right now but at this point i gotta give this game some breathing room i'm not even sure it's fucking the whole thing uh stream we'll see all right guys take care Take care of yourself. This thing has been going for. Oh, you're kidding me. It did that whole bullshit where it reset.